Hello and welcome back to another episode of City Skylights with our highways in here. And we have the Light Horse Interchange in Sydney, Australia. So this would be a, another big one and um, I'll do my best to make sure that this looks like the, the real thing. But uh, a few things to uh, consider here how I'm going to build this. So we have this map which is a uh, interchange testing uh, which is the same one as we used last time and we're building this in the middle here and then we will direct the traffic through this interchange just to show you how that works and to prove that it actually works so we have the map the Google map on the screen now and that's done using the image overlay mod so you can get a square image put on the, the folder and when you load the game, it shows up in the center of the screen. You can move left and right, you know, increase the size, reduce the size, and this is the size that it's going to be. So we are building that and making sure that looks as good as the real thing. We'll start doing the road layout, then we will elevate the, um, um, the highway and make the bridges and all that sort of stuff. So we have like different levels. And then that will be followed by using node controller and intersection marking tool so we can make the junctions and the actually uh, entrance and exits of the ramps uh, a little bit better and smoother as we usually do so it looks a little bit more realistic. And finally, I'll connect everything to our uh, network here. So I'll probably um, have to do some traffic redirection so they can use just one word uh, actually four of these interchanges and all the traffic goes through the middle here so we can see how that works but wow well, that and um, i hope you enjoy and enjoy the music as well and i'll see you when i finish
Drown to deep, no strength to fight. My guy so good, and my ego is so
And we are finally done. So here would be the unveiling of the Light Horse Interchange in Sydney, New South Wales, Australia. There we go. It took me just around three hours uh, over, I think, three days. I, I split the, the work into three days as well. But all the markings, all the road levels, all the uh, elevation and uh, node controller and even well just everything with the exception of one I forgot to just align the the height of this one there we go we should be aligned that is just something a little bit odd on this one but I'll fix that but anyway um what else have we done here we've done the um, lane selected as well so that's also done and yeah i think it's all it's all finished it's all working really really well and i think this would be the the secret here to get this right so get all the way over there and hopefully this is slightly better yeah it is it should be all good now but yeah and then i've also had some uh, bonus here like with the bicycle pathways we have these going through the whole interchange that is like a bike highway coming through here have access over there have access all the way through here to the junction this little bridge here we actually have a road underneath that but this is not part of the junction itself it just goes all the way through here might connect on this road later on but yeah I, I kept that out but yeah this has been a nice um, challenge and I enjoy it just the connections here these roads I end up connecting all the way over here although I've used the, a different road for some reason I don't know why and but the cars barely use that mainly because that is like this path is uh, a little bit slower and longer and i did the same on the other side as well but again it's uh, a little bit slower over there and that's actually bothering me <laughs> i'll just update this road here so we we have the right one and there we go so that looks better now but then we have this tunnel in here as well that goes underneath was as well it was a tunnel but it was just like an underpass not really a, a full tunnel and as we don't have a, really a way to do an underpass in city skylines i've ended up doing this in here obviously there's no detailing in here, so adding detailing would help quite a lot, making this look a lot better. But yeah, it will, I'll put this up in the workshop as well. The link will be in the description. This will be up, up as a map. So this map, the way you see in here, and then you can take this and you can, uh, for example, use, I think you can use node controller if you select basically everything like you select all and then you have a way to actually export the selection 
and then you can import that into your own map and it will be everything as it's set up in here. So yeah, I think I mentioned about the lane selector as well. So everything is in there so they don't go where they shouldn't be. I don't think I missed any on these junctions in here. I set that with the uh, lane arrow. So basically setting this up as this and I did on this one as well. So it's all um, functioning as it should. And yeah, I hope you've enjoyed. Oh, by the way, there's this weird shaped road in here, but it is like that. Like, unfortunately, you can't see on the overlay. But if you look at the uh, actual map, you see that exactly like that, which is interesting. You have one over here and you have one in here actually yeah when you merge so i don't know if they use this for like some police checkpoints or i don't know but yeah they, they are there so it's all working and even this like it's interesting how you merge and then you go from one lane into the highway and but yeah this is how it works so i i kept it that way but I'll leave you with uh, some cinematics and let me know in the comments what you think. And if you're enjoying this new series, just building interchains, um, we still have a lot of requests to build. So I'll probably keep doing this from time to time, not building everything at the same time, because, well, that'll be... I won't have the time to do it, really. It'll be... <laughs> Um, this takes like each interchange takes uh, as you can see about three to five hours and Some are more complicated some are a little bit easier to do Each one of them has their own challenge, but it, it's been fun to build that. So really really hope you enjoy it uh, Let me know in the comments leave a like as well and Hopefully I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye